no be you, if no be you, God of chosen, we will not be alive. If no be you, that if no be you, for the journey may cease. For your protections, for the daily bread, for our families. Oh, if no be you, that if no be you, for helping my pastor all these years. For the journey misses, mighty protection. Oh, if no be you, all these crusades. Oh, if no be you, all the cancers, all these HIVs. If no be you, all the barrenness for your mighty protection, for mighty provision, oh my dear life, for healing our sicknesses, for that sickness. Oh, if no be you, for our entire families, that if no be you, if no be you, my dear Lord, we will not be alive. If no be you, for these 17 years, that if no be you, for these 70 years, that if no be you, for protecting my pastor, oh, for this troubling, oh, my dear Lord, for going to every country, oh, our dear Lord, for the choosing children, for the choosing youth, all of our pastors, for the women leaders, for every department, you, my dear Lord, for giving us this grace. You are the Lord, that if no be you, if no be you, our dear Lord, we will not be alive. Oh, our Father, we thank you, we worship you. Daddy, we adore you, we reverence your name. We thank you for your love. We thank you, Lord, for your guidance, your protection. Thank you for the great and mighty things you have been doing since the inception of this movement. Daddy, since the inception of this ministry till now, we lack words, Daddy, to appreciate you. We thank you, Daddy, today. We have come to celebrate. We have come, O oh Lord, to appreciate you this day for all you have been doing for the chosen ones. We say, let your name alone be glorified in Jesus' name. If not you, Daddy, we would have been forgotten. Many of you, our chapter would have been closed. But, Daddy, you so much love us. Your love is so great that we cannot be able to comprehend. Daddy, in unity of faith, with all our heart this morning, we come to say thank you, dear Lord. We appreciate you. We say that let your name alone be glorified in Jesus' name. Daddy, today, O oh Lord, as we are dwelling in your presence this day, Daddy, we pray, Daddy, that God, O oh Lord, today will visit us mightily. Continue in fellowship with us. 
At the end, your name alone be glorified in Jesus' name. We we'll cover our garden with the blood of Jesus Christ. Cover every congregation with the blood of Jesus Christ. All our brethren who are still on their way to this place, Daddy, provide the safest means of transportation for them. Remove every hindrances on their way so that all of them will come and be a partaker of this blessing in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. If you have a testimony to share with us, I know there are so many testimonies today to be shared. You are expected now to go to my left hand side there where the testimony interviews are so that the privilege to share a testimony will be given to you. Amen. Today, today, there is a melody in my heart. Today, melody in my heart. You need to rejoice today. You need to rejoice. Melody in my heart. Hallelujah. Today, there is a melody in my heart. Melody, my heart today. There is a melody in my heart today. Melody, in my heart. Hallelujah. Today, there is a melody in my heart. Melody, 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 melody. There is a melody in my heart. Melody, in my heart. Hallelujah. Today, there is a melody in my heart. Melody, in my heart. Today, there is a melody in my heart. Today, melody, in my heart. Hallelujah. Today. There is a melody in my heart. Melody, 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 melody. There is a melody in my heart. Melody in my heart. Hallelujah. Today. There is a melody in my heart. Melody in my heart today. There is a melody in my heart. Melody in my heart today. There is a melody in my heart. Melody in my heart. Hallelujah today. There is a melody in my heart. Melody, 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 melody. There is a melody in my heart today. Your hands, your hands, your hands, your hands. My Jesus today. My Jesus tomorrow. My Jesus forever. He's a wonderful God. He's a wonderful God. My Jesus today, tomorrow, that is my Jesus forever. Amen. He say wonder. I say he's a wonderful God. Hallelujah. I say, my Jesus today, our Jesus tomorrow, our Jesus forever. He's a wonderful God. He's a wonderful God. Our Jesus today. Hallelujah, my Jesus forever. I say he's a wonderful God My Jesus today My Jesus tomorrow My Jesus forever He's a wonder I say he's a wonderful God My Jesus today 
Tomorrow, Daddy, my Jesus, forever. He said, Wonder, I say, He said, Wonderful God. My Jesus today, my Jesus tomorrow, my Jesus forever. He said, Wonder, I say, He said, Wonderful God. My Jesus today, tomorrow. Jesus forever. He say wonder. I say he say wonderful God. Appreciate him. You will see him rise up this morning in his throne. Hallelujah, my Jesus forever. He say wonder. I say he say wonderful God. Our Jesus today. Our Jesus tomorrow, our Jesus forever. He say wonder, I say he say wonderful God. Hallelujah. Tomorrow, my Jesus forever. He say wonder, your hands, your hands, your hands, your hands. I am rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. Oh, I am rejoicing. I say I am rejoicing. We are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. Oh, we are rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. I am rejoicing. I am rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. I say I am rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Choosing we are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. I say we are rejoicing. Brethren, we are rejoicing. We are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. I say we are rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I say I am rejoicing, brethren, we are rejoicing. We are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. Oh, we are rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I say I am rejoicing, brethren, we are rejoicing. We are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. I say we are rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Oh, Hallelujah. I'm not sure if you are rejoicing today. I am rejoicing. I am rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. Oh, I am rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Brethren, hallelujah. Oh, I am rejoicing. I say we are rejoicing. We are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. Oh, we are rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Everybody. I say we are rejoicing, oh we are rejoicing, we are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. I say we are rejoicing, praise the Lord, all the Jesus people. Oh, hallelujah. Satan, oh, we are rejoicing. I say we are rejoicing. We are rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. Oh, we are rejoicing. Praise the Lord. Your hands, your hands, your hands, your hands, your hands. Why not follow us and rejoice with the Lord? Why not follow us? Chosen people, why not follow me? I say, why not follow me? Everybody, why not follow me? I say, why not follow me? I'm rejoicing. Everybody, why not follow us? 
Brothers, why not follow us? My sisters, why not follow us? Chosen people, why not follow us? Newcomers, why not follow us? Brother, why not follow us? Everybody, why not follow us? 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 Everybody, why not follow us? Everybody, why not follow us? Why not follow us? Why not follow us and rejoice in? Everybody, why not follow us? Children, why not follow us? Our youth, why not follow us? Why not follow us? Everybody, why not follow us? I say, why not follow us? I rejoice in the Lord. Your hands, your hands. Your hands, your hands to this God. The clapping is too small, though. The way it is in my heart today. <laughs> Your hands, your hands. Almighty Father, thank you. Almighty Father, thank you. Daddy, we have nothing to give you but to say thank you, Lord. Almighty Father, thank you. God of choosing. Oh, God of choosing. Hallelujah, we have nothing to give you but to say thank you, Lord. Oh, God of choosing, our Father, oh, may we have nothing to give you just to say thank you, Lord. Your hands, your hands. Almighty Father, thank you. Daddy Almighty Father, thank you. We have nothing to give you, just to say thank you, Lord. Almighty Father, thank you. God of choosing. I say God of choosing. Papa, we have nothing to give you, just to say thank you, Lord. Almighty Father, thank you. I say God of choosing. God of choosing. Daddy, we have nothing to give you, but to say thank you, Lord. Almighty Father, thank you. I say God of choosing. God of choosing. Amen. We have nothing to give you just to say thank you, Lord. Onya who may run is I gave me is a Onya who may run is I gave me a God of choosing me run is I gave me is a Onya who may run is I gave me a Brethren, may I one day may I one day may I oh may I can you may I can you may I can you may I may I one day may I be able is a be able is a be able is a be able is a be able is it be a be 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 Is it be your joy we can feel it we can see it it is glowing it's all over the world all over the world today people of God are rejoicing the chosen people are celebrating I say we can see it all over your faces we can see the joy we can see the happiness 
We can see the celebration. We can see the atmosphere. Everything singing to the glory of God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Happy anniversary. Welcome to another day of special celebration. It's a special one because we know that every day in the Lord chosen is a day of celebration. But today's own is unique, is peculiar. It is special. And uh, every living being, including non-living being, will be impacted with the joy that will resonate from you to heaven today in Jesus' name. Welcome to this 17th anniversary of the Lord Chosen Charismatic Revival Movement being celebrated today, the 22nd day of the month of December, month of deliverance and dominion. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. I'd like you to greet the people all over the world. Wave unto them. Wave unto all the people all over the world, all the chosen people, all the fellowship centers of chosen. Let all this glory go to God as we greet them, as we salute God of chosen, every glory, all honor, dominion, adoration, majesty, power, receive you, O oh God, from the chosen world all over the world. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Can we wave unto God again in appreciation? Wave unto him. Appreciate him. Magnify the Lord. It is so special. It's so unique. Peculiar. So astounding. So epochal. Oh, God of choosing, we worship you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for what you have done in our lives in the world. Thank you, oh God, for this record breaking operation in 17 years. Thank you, God of the chosen. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. I would like us also to wave unto God on behalf of our pastor, the G of the chosen, the captain of this ship. Wave unto God and appreciate him for election of God upon his life, for the appointment and anointing, special, peculiar, unique appointment and power. Wave unto God and appreciate him. It is the calling that has created this echo of holiness, of born again, of miracle, of signs and wonders all over the world. We appreciate you, God, for your servant, our pastor. Thank you, O oh God. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Shall we be seated now? Please be seated. It's a unique day. It's a special day. It's a Thanksgiving day. It's a, an, a, a day of appreciation to God, whom alone has done this. No other being, no other power, but God, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, God of the chosen, that has made you and me to be partakers of heavenly blessings by the order of this ministry. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Apart from our thanksgiving, worship, celebration, special offerings that will take place today, we are going to also going to celebrate today with testimonies. Testimony. And so if you are there, you have a testimonies of God of chosen, and we know that you do, please go to my left hand side by the pulpit area. We shall give you opportunity to testify including some of those great testimonies that happened during the year that we have even heard of already. Great testimonies that happened these 17 years that you have testified before. We'll be ready to feature them again today to continue to celebrate 
the special presence and power of God in the Lord chosen. So, we urge you to go to my left hand side by the pulpit area. Our testimony interviewers are waiting. They will give you opportunity to testify. Praise the Lord. Now I want to recognize and welcome guests and invitees into this special fellowship, this special Thanksgiving Appreciation Day in the Lord Chosen Charismatic Revival Movement. Today is therefore your first time in the Lord Chosen Charismatic Revival Movement. Kindly rise on your feet wherever you are for appropriate recognition and welcome. All those for whom this is the first time you are coming into the Lord Chosen Charismatic Revival Movement, be kind to rise on your feet now. For we have been praying for you, and now that you are here, you deserve every recognition, happy welcome, every appreciation. On behalf of our beloved pastor, the general overseer of the Lord Chosen Charismatic Revival Movement, the founder, the arrowhead of this ministry, we welcome all of you with the greatest blessing is that you should be in heaven at last. And uh, this is properly and appropriately captured in 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 19, where it says, if in this life only we have hope in Christ, we are of all men most miserable. Now the mission, the mandate, is to win 10 billion souls, 10 billion souls into the kingdom of God. That is the mandate, the mission, very large, massive, and audacious target but I can tell you that what has happened in these 17 years, it is already done. 10 billion souls mandate is already achieved. So welcome into this ship. Welcome into the ship that is heading to heaven. We assure you that as you continue, and we know that you will continue, as you continue, you will enjoy all the blessings of God in this world. And at the end of your life, make heaven at last in Jesus' name. Our fellowship days. God has also commanded that we meet with him regularly for maximum blessings. Every Sunday, we meet in what is titled the Sunday worship, time of worship and study of the Holy Scriptures to create awareness and then bring about the knowledge of God. Sunday worship in this headquarters of the Lord chosen comes in different dimensions with respect to time of starting, usually every first Sunday and third Sundays of the month. We hold what we term regular service. And the service here begins by 8 a.m. At the same time, all the fellowship centers of the Lord chosen in Lagos are activated at the same 8 a.m. Second Sundays of every month is usually a combined service. And there are two sessions. All the worshipers in Lagos gather under this roof to worship God, even God of chosen. In two sessions, the first service beginning 6 a.m a.m. to close 9.30, 10 a.m. thereabout. And second session commencing immediately after that to close 2, 3 p.m. in the afternoon. Every last Sunday of the month is also a combined service, but it's a single service and it is a crusade in its own right. Time for starting that fellowship last Sundays of the month is 7 a.m. On Sundays also, we hold our house care fellowships, and this is a fellowship where brethren gather in their local homes to learn and adopt the love and care of early apostles. Usually a one-hour program. It starts by 6 p.m. and closes by 7 p.m. The good thing you will do to yourself is to locate the house care address that is closest to you and begin to attend every Sunday. Every Tuesday, we hold the revival hour. And this is a miracle service, time for demonstration of God's power to rule away sicknesses, diseases, and all the problems of life, and then bring about the needed revival to our souls. Revival hour in this headquarters of the Lord chosen comes in two sessions. The morning session starts 8 a.m., closing about 1 in the afternoon, or before 1 p.m. And the second session starts by 5 p.m. in the evening, to close before 8.30 p.m. usually. Every Wednesday, our pastor has proposed and designed to meet specially with all our guests and invitees. This is really a very special, very close-range session, 5 p.m. every Wednesday in the conference hall, very close to the express as you enter the choosing revival ground. 
That's where this fellowship holds. 5 p.m. for all our guests and invitees. And on Thursdays, we hold counseling and deliverance service. Another wonderful session that you cannot afford to miss. 6 30 a.m. here in this crusade worship center. Every Thursday, it happens big and large in release of the power of God. And people are empowered very early to launch out from here about 11 a.m. to demonstrate the power of God in dominion, in miracle, and in victory. And then return quickly with the testimonies of God. Don't miss those days. It's a special day. Advertise it every Thursday. Make your way to this place. You are sure to go out in dominion, in miracle, and in victory. Every Saturday, we hold Bible studies and workers' meeting. Bible studies. The Lord chosen charismatic revival movement is totally and absolutely anchored on the Bible. Everything about this ministry is the Bible. And so time is taken to teach the brethren the word of the Bible, the way to heaven every Saturday by 12 noon. Make sure you join. Make sure you arrive here in good time to be part of everything that happens on Saturday preparatory to making heaven at last. Apart from these weekly programs, there are retreats and crusades that take place from time to time across the entire world. And this year has been very, very eventful in number of crusades that held all over the world. Virtually every continent was visited by the pastor of the chosen in, in crusades, in retreats, and in special programs. Name it, whether it was in America or in Canada or in Dubai, Benin Republic, you can continue to name them, even in China and many other countries in Africa, Liberia. They are too numerous to name. And in Nigeria here, virtually many states received special crusades of the Lord chosen. Where the general overseer was in attendance, he was the officiating minister. And uh, that was also what happened in the previous years. And uh, we still have crusades lined up to close the year after today's crusade, after today's celebration. The celebration will continue on the 25th of December and 26th of December in another dimension titled, Only God Can Do This. And from there, brethren and the people of the world will be prepared to change their garments on 1st of January. It's usually a special one. Very, very refreshing, great and mighty. January 1st, 2020 will be another special day, change of garment, where chosen people and worshippers on the program will be clothed with new garment, glorious garment, athletic garment, garments of favor. And immediately after that, people will rush and run by air, by land and sea to Mbwidi to join the multitude of people that are already there. And that will happen in that great annual event crusade that opens the year for choosing people all over the world titled, What God Has Determined Shall Be Done, happening 3, 4, 5, 6, January 2020. All for you, all for the chosen, all for the world, to continue to be blessed and to be empowered by God or chosen. Praise the Lord. We'd like to believe that by now, our guests and invitees would have received the newcomer's card. Today is your first time in the Lord chosen. We urge you, plead with you, to receive those cards from our protocol brethren and fill out all the information required therein, give them to us accurately, and then return them quickly to the protocol brethren that is standing by you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Time for all of us to now rise on our faith as we go to the Lord in prayer. Rise on your faith as we go to the Lord in prayer. Thou art worthy, O Lord, worthy, my Lord, to receive. And power, o Thou 
art worthy, Lord. What am I, Lord? I'm power. We have seen the Lord's goodness, His mercies and compassion. We have seen the Lord's goodness. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. His mercies and compassion. We have seen. Hallelujah. Oh Lord, you have. Been so good, you are so good to us, O oh Lord. Open your mouth and begin to worship God. Exalt his name, magnify his name. Adore him and reverence him. Worship the Lord. Give him praise. Salute him. Wave unto him. Bow down before him. Exalt the name of the Most High God. The God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. God of the chosen. God of the pastor of chosen. Worship him. Lift his name high. Declare his majesty. Worship the Lord. Open your mouth. Sing praise his honor. Adoration. Worship unto this great God. Heavenly Father. The great Jehovah. The God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. God of the chosen. God of the pastor of chosen. We worship you, we praise you, we exalt thee and magnify thy name. Be thou exalted, be thou magnified. Forever we must worship you. Thank you very, very much. Thank you, dear Lord. Thank you, precious daddy. Thank you for answer to prayer. Thank you for your benefits, benevolence, kindness, love and care, miracles and salvation, prosperity, elevation and promotion, higher level blessings, that you have thrust upon the chosen people all over the world. Thank you for 17 years of successful, great and mighty oppression all over the world. Our Father, we appreciate you. We magnify thy name. We adore you and reverence you. We give you every praise. All the chosen people all over the world, present and future people, we rise in unity of faith. We declare your majesty. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. I want us to pray against all enemy actions. Bring them under subjection. Crush them, bind them, destroy them. Whatever they are, whether they be spirits, kingdoms, groups and entities, personalities, whatever committee, formations, that they have raised, walking again, the children stepped up. Already they have seen that I have failed. Now we are going to chase them and destroy them permanently. Wherever they are, all the enemies of righteousness and holiness, all those that are propagating rumors, evil reports against this ministry, they have seen their shame and their nakedness. Because the choosing is 17. And very soon we clock 20. And very soon we clock 100. And as the Lord of tarries, the Lord chosen will continue to exist. And the power to the glory of God. So we're going to pray and command total destruction to the camps of the enemy. Wherever they are, in any world, planet, rim or quarter, release and command Holy God, fight. Holy God, fight. 
Holy Ghost! <clears throat> oh yeah, begin to destroy them. Crush them to pieces. Bind them, bind their power. of our Lord Jesus Christ on the authority and mandate you have given unto us we command total destruction to the camps of the enemy whatever that represents enmity against righteousness and holiness against our vision and mission against our program and lifespan we release Holy Ghost fire thunder, earthquake, tsunami, disaster attack them, bring them down, overthrow them crush them to pieces we close their chapter we destroy their weapon. We return all their weakness back to sender. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. We are going to pray for our pastor, the general overseer of the Lord Chosen Charismatic Revival Movement, the arrowhead of this ministry, the founder. The man with a vision and mission. The one that God has used to create a new order, new love and joy in serving God and in following God. The one that God has used to make the world see again that the word of God is true and that God is real. We want to thank God for his calling, anointing and power and pray that God will continue to advance him in every direction conquering everything and bringing them to his subjection we will pray that God will every moment renew his strength and energy maintain him and among in the Lord in the best state of health shape and form that God will continue increase and multiply speaking to our pastor mouth to mouth that everything our pastor needs in wisdom in insight and knowledge understanding create him and understanding spirit unction anointing and power wealth and rich resources to power this ministry into every village all over the world that God will release them to him in abundance as we are praying for our pastor we have to join our mom in the Lord together there on this mission and vision and also pray for their children pray for their entire family members nuclear and extended that all their generation will continually draw from this confidence that God has given unto him I want you to pray for our pastor now pray for automatic and continuous maintenance from above, that God will renew his strength and energy, maintain him and a moment the Lord to remain youthful, strong and healthy, like 15 year old and 10 years old respectively pray that the organs, all the organs in the body of our pastor, a moment the Lord from the crown of their head to the sole of their feet, inside and outside will operate like 15 year old and 10 years old all the way, forever, pray for our pastor, pray that God will use him mightily today to bless the entire world that this celebration will be very, very visible in the life of every chosen, in the life of the world, as we go into the program to the prayer for our pastor. Open your mouth and pray for him diversely. Pray that he will never be weary. He will never be weak. Pray that no part of his body will ever entertain sickness, weakness, pain, stress. Pray that every moment he will be filled with overflowing joy. Pray for our pastor. Pray for our mom in the Lord. Pray for their children. Pray for his entire family members. Heavenly Father, the Almighty God, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, God of the prophets, God of the pastor of chosen, we salute you, we greet you, we magnify your name. Thank you very, very much for creating your servant, our pastor, for anointing and empowering him to take charge of 10 billion souls mandate. Thank you for the journey so far. So wonderful and excellent. We pray that you continue to help him advance him, increase him on all sides, multiply the grace, continue to speak to him mouth to mouth, 
help him, help our mom and the Lord, help their children to continue to pile up this ship, oh God. I pray that his entire family members, generation to come, will continually draw from this covenant you gave to him. I pray that all the choosing people, all the people of the world, will draw from this covenant. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of my pastor. For in Jesus' mighty name, we pray. We're going to thank God specially for this 17-year operation of the Lord choosing. Very successful, highly successful, record-breaking, epoca, and uh, whatever you want to use to describe what has happened all over the world, choosing is the church to join. And that is the truth. That's the church. That is the ministry to join all over the world, not just in Nigeria, not only in Africa, all over the world. We need to thank God and then pray that today's celebration will be unique and special. That God will receive all our thanksgiving, all our appreciation, every substance, every material, every money, whatever we want to also use to demonstrate our love and our appreciation, that they will be worthy and that God will receive them like sweet smelling sacrifices. I want you to pray, thank God for the 17 years and pray that today indeed we resonate in the life of all the worshippers in the choosing today as a special day of thanksgiving, day of appreciation. That the joy that we flow in choosing today will touch all the people of the world. Begin to pray. Thank God for the success, huge successes, massive successes that God has recorded for choosing in this year. All these 17 years. Heavenly Father, we appreciate you. We can never, never thank you enough. What you have done for us, we cannot count them. It is impossible to count them. What you've done for the world, by the hand of this ministry, is so much. It's unbelievable. It's unimaginable. We appreciate you, therefore we thank you immensely. We pray that you take over the celebration today, the thanksgiving appreciation, the organization here in the headquarters and all over the world where this celebration is taking place today. We pray that all the worshippers will be connected to your glory, that all the thanksgiving, all the appreciation, whatever we are going to use with my father to appreciate you, sanctify them, multiply them, make them to be worthy before you and receive them like sweet smelling sacrifice. All our songs, all our dances, all our testimonies, all the choristal renditions, my Father and our God, sanctify them and magnify your name upon everything we are doing today. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. And amen. Shall we be seated? Now, please be seated. As we take the children's choir immediately, children's choir is already on the podium to bless the church. The children cry out to minister now. Mm -hmm. 